Hello everyone, I'm Rob Smith, the Smith of the Black Channel here, Ticker Talker, and uh, it's the Strat Time Report. What's going on? we got a newsy tape here, right? So there's a few things you want to keep an eye on here. So if we go to the SPY, right, we knew we had a ton of inside days, right? Right here, go over left. Now you can see both of these days are still in this bar here, called the Mother Bar. We can't get out of there. That's a problem, and that's why you can expect this back and forth action until we can get out of there. So there's a few things you want to keep an eye on. Once again, can we take this out and go all the way back up and come out of here because this weekly most things are still too weak to the downside taking out last week's lows we haven't negated that just yet right so it gets stuck in here and then if you go to a 60 you see this inside on the 60 and so right now we have the four broader averages all inside on the 60 so we want to see how we can get out of here here's qqq still inside inside day in QQQ and so when you have that you can expect to get chopped up until we can get out of there and so if you're trying to trade the futures you might be getting killed all right if you go to small cappers here once again inside 60 if you go to Dow Jones diamonds inside 60 so either side of those 60s gets our attention and then you got to get out of that mother bar so we got issues and this is what can happen when you get later in the month in the lower middle, the inside month. So everything's inside month, right? And then you get your inside days and then inside 60. So uh, we did start to have some good selling in the morning. We're kind of hoping to follow through. Uh, but newsy tape and start talking about stimulus package that firmed up the market a bit. Um, and so it's just going to be a, that, that type of tape for right now. So if we go to MRIN. Here you go. And this thing hasn't been easy. Uh, but certainly on the move and you can see here like in the 15 not easy here this was nice and easy right and so was this here you can see this it goes down it goes inside on in the 15 and there's your reversal boom this thing exploded from 206 and went up over four then it comes down here this is an inside bar this pokes down there's your rev strat right there boom over 307 and boom off she goes so we'll see the, not for everybody moving around so we go to some of the Keep going or to keep going to the well, and you've got Star Surgical now inside in the 60s, still making new highs on the inside month and up. I've been talking about that all week. And UTHR still trying to go here, albeit stalling out right now. ARWR, how you doing? Just going down the list and things. We got a new low list kicking in here. We got news again. Okay, so if you go to the spy here. few things you want to look at too the daily continuity see now it's going back right on the daily right and if it re-breaks this thing now you got problems and we're coming after that 60 down in here and you can see this how this new stuff kicks in right there on right there as soon as the the new hour starts we call that the flip right we want to see what's going and right there inside five and right back down so be aware of that um if we go to paypal how are you doing Things are changing mighty quickly here, as you can see. PayPal coming back in. PayPal gapped up a little bit off the inside day, but now you can see this new 60. All right, goes up here in the new 60. Everything's starting to change here again. I'm going to see if they bring them all in. So you can see that, uh, yeah, that QQQ. So I'm just trying to keep an eye on this, watching these 60s to see if they break. Uh, Travelers was having a nice morning here. Travelers. Now we'll see if it stays 60 or 30. Travelers taking out last month's highs. You can see that. That's a 2-2 reversal to the upside. So Travelers now, like I said, newsy stuff. Now we'll see if we get an inside 30 up in there. It was bringing up uh, the chub with that CB presently inside on the 30. So keeping an eye on these futures to see how hard they want to hit them. You've got GWPH now coming back in with GWPH. Watching to see if this inside week in the upper middle, above 98.35, you're right about there to see if you can take that out. Because you see it on this daily, this is the pattern we look for, the shooter, hammer, and then back up through. So we'll see what goes on there. Teradyne. And Teradyne right now goes inside on the 30, trying to negate that and come back in. But you can see in the monthly lower middle, Pokes up, pokes down, boom. Now we're looking to take this out and go into the highs above 93.43. But uh, as I said, things can change on a dime here with us, this newsy tape. If we go to WD-40, now it's stuck up in here. But you see, that's a nice opening move. Now it's just stuck in this Mulder bar, so we'll keep an eye on these 60s 
here inside inside 60 to see if we can get outside of that we go to Spotify Spotify also holding up as an inside 60 up in here if we can get through that still inside month but remember outside month inside month and there's a lot of that it tells us we have potential broadening formation so we want to see if we can be strong enough on the weekly to come up and take these guys out and on the daily you're going to notice this pokes down to two down two two boom and back to previous range so it stalls out just a tad because it you had it did what it was supposed to do Take, once you take this out, we're going to trigger these guys and these guys and these guys and stop them out. And boom, there we go. And that's called exhaustion risk. Now you get up here, now the buyer's got to step up. Right now, this market getting heavy. You got the Dow Jones Diamonds taking the 60 down, starting to take the lead there. So one of the things you want to keep watching is to see if all four break. Right? So you can see Dow Jones Diamonds taking this inside 60 to the downside. Now you want to see if that gets them all going. Spy. Just right there, QQQ, not yet. Small cappers, not yet. So you want to see if all four of those start breaking. That's going to get my attention. If we go to snow, snow inside on the 60, and it gets our attention because the upper middle is an inside weak to the upside, right? So we'll see. Like I said, these futures are starting to try and come in here. ONVO, ONVO. And this thing you can see here on the monthly in the lower middle, lower low, boom, higher high coming back through that. Potential outside week here in the upper middle as it comes back through. And here you go, outside day of the upside coming back through previous range. So that's so far so good. HAE. And HAE just stalling out here now, but you can see here green on all time frames when that 60 goes back green. So we'll see what goes there. Watching these futures just teeter on those lines, but Western Digi, and one of the few, the proud, the inside day and upper, and inside week and upper, and outside one bar rev strat month are for WDC. But at this point, there's a lot more things triggering to the downside, especially in the weeklies, and that has not been negated. Netflix, gapping down here. You see the broadening formation here, potential outside, outside month coming back through this broadening formation here. So if you go to, down to your 30, you would have seen this here, inside 30 to the downside, now outside. So just kind of chopping around sideways there for now. Uh, iRobot. And this, trying to fight back again, but if you look at here, on the daily, when it opened and it didn't gap, right, and that was it went way up last night and then came all the way back down. But as soon as it takes this out, there's your 2-2 reversal on the daily. That's below 91.75, trading 83.31. Now we'll have to see if we can get another 60 to set up down there. Uh, some financials getting hit. Capital One staying on the lows. You can see that inside week to the downside right there. The 212, the downside. Inside day to the downside. And you can watch that with like DFS. Having some issues here, American Express, some financials. Um, also, in the Stratatac show, talked about um, watching for some of these high flyers to see if they turn around. Yeah, JKS trying, and then rip back up. And now, here, now maybe we get the outside day here, in the JKS, you see. And here, on the 60, this makes a slight higher high. So below this for the next hour, 77.99, that's a 2, 2, 2 to go try and finish the job and finish the outside day because we got that in Peloton here Peloton gave us the outside day there's your opening 60 boom three and then two and now trying to go inside 60 to the downside to continue that still handling an inside week but looking for some of these flyers to cool off and we certainly got it especially right here look at this up 2-2 two -two reversal on the 15 and BAM so we'll see now here on the 15 you can see this inside bar pokes up comes back there's ref strat boom let's take all these guys out and hopefully that in one shot one two two if we go to enph another one got him good here poke up come back for the three all right on the day and it was a little quick on these but we'll see if it sets up again you had this now potential outside week all right and that's what we look for uh, if we go to d dog and d dog here on the weekly this is what a lot of these things are doing that's why it wouldn't surprise me for this market to get hit right now just kind of holding on by a thread but anytime you have a up week then down 
22, below 104.55, and you can keep an eye on that for the rest of the, of the week because there's a lot of things doing that. We've been watching Okta Octas here, back through the tries, still going on the daily. Now we'll see if we can get these 60s to break, like so. There's an inside 60 in the lower left, and you can see the 2-2 two, two reversal week up and then back through, right? So that's still good. Uh, if we go to IRTC, in IRTC, we like coming back through the previous range, right? So you can see that pokes up. Now this two weeks become an outside bar of this in the upper middle, you see? Still going, and now potentially in the monthly, an outside month, a nice red month. Coming back through the previous range is good because anybody who stays long this, it's going to be long versus that, 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 that. And we get that house of cards going and see if we can bring them in. If we go to Tandem. In tandem, here on the weekly, pokes up, comes back through, previous range, right? Doesn't gap. And so anytime this week below 115.52 gets my attention, trade 110, and then we'll see if we can get this to keep going down there. It needs to set up again as it's going straight into lows on the 60. LMT, Lockheed Martin, once again talked about this yesterday. Now you got an inside 60 lower middle, I mean lower left, to see if that can keep going. All right, these broader averages trying to stabilize here. And here, once again, the inside bar, the poke up, the boom, and stop them out. So you take all these guys out, and you also take this month out. So we'll see if this 60 can get it going for some more puking, and you can watch more aerospace defense with that. If we go to Sedge. Sedge gives us the outside week here. Pokes up and then comes back down through. That's good. And you can see here, coming back to the previous range where there's a lot of pivots for people to try and stay long again. So looking to see if we can take out a few more of these guys and bring her down on the downside. If we go to EHTH. The EHTH here. Just getting slammed. You can see this lower left, the inside 60 down. Now you have a new 60 starting to firm up. But uh, we'll see if this has anything more left in it. This is what I'm talking about, though. When it takes this out on the daily, then you have all this. We call that the pivot machine gun. So you stopped all those guys out. Now we'll see if the seller steps down. If we go to Wingstop. Wingstop. Once again, your outside, inside week into the downside, right? Which is taking out last month's lows and going into the lows. We'll see if that sets up again. Some nice downside action in wing stop. More high flyers we're looking for. NVCR. And NVCR taking out last week's lows, right? So below 130, 181. Trying to negate that month. We're getting low on the month. You have your inside day to the downside. Now trying to stabilize with other things, but we'll see what comes of that. If we go to NVAX, NVAX, once again, nice days down here, You're going for a third day in a row, off the inside week, rev strat back through previous range, and we can watch that with Marna, inside week, pokes up, boom, coming back through the previous range, still making new lows, now you're inside on the 60 to keep an eye on that, what's going on here in NXPI? too much. Okay, if we go to Fiverr, F-V-R-R, -R, you see this inside day here, upper left, boom, back to previous range to give you the outside week. Now it goes inside on the 60, so we'll see if there's any more sets up there. With the crowd coming in, in the crowd, once again, you're looking at that weekly here, pokes up, comes back through the previous range changing the month red now and now you're inside on the 60 overstock keeping an eye on this because it coming back to previous range on the weekly now and inside 60 we'll see what comes of that like i said be careful get your stops in there because we got a newsy tape so make sure you got stops in there so you can get out of the way for tomorrow, I'm not going to be in so i will see you all on friday to see if we can how we want to finish off the week all right, I'm Rob Smith. This is the Black Channel here, Tiger Tiger, with the Strat Time Report.